In this video, I'm going to update you on my interpretation of the Edison PowerClerk NEM 2.0 application system. Uh, what Edison is going to be doing with respect to accepting and processing subsequent to the April 14th, 23 deadline. Here is my interpretation of what's going on. They say that the requ all the required documents and for installers, it means one thing, and for owner uh, people, it means another. I'm owner installer, and for me, it means a single line diagram, and uh, it also means that I may need a, a justification, and uh, I think it would be good to use a plot plan, but you can look at my other videos w with respect to that. But the major documents you're going to have to look at, and it, it can be submitted no later than April 14th. That means no matter how busy that they get, it looks like you can submit prior uh, to April 15th. And those documents need to be free of major deficiencies. And my interpretation of that is you're going to have to fill out the line diagram. You're going to have to fill out the boxes correctly in the, the application. I've done some videos on on that, and that would will require some research to to make the hurdle free of major deficiencies. But I think it's not a big hurdle. And then they're also saying that these programs are subject to change, so I don't know what that means. And the solar billing uh, plan fact, I, I haven't looked at it, but you could have a look of, at that. So they're saying that it's taking up to 20 days to, to process. And 20 days before April 14th would be passed today. So they're saying that don't worry that applications submitted that are that have no major errors will continue through the review process. And they're going to be on a first come first serve basis. I assume that's going to be what your time stamp and date stamp is for your submission. And they're also saying that all applications deemed valid will proceed under the M NEM 2.0 program. So uh, once deemed valid, which could be after you correct minor minor changes minor things that they disagree with not major they'll kick you out for 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 major if it's if it's not free of major you're you're going to get kicked out so i think that it's in your best interest to double check and do quite a bit of research and it's okay probably if you think something is a little bit shaky right now in your application i would go ahead and make it clearer and if you if you're for instance if you don't have a single line diagram if your single line diagram is good and maybe you, d you make a plot plan maybe you do do the justification and make sure that you 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 have you're not asking for too much power and I would also think about adding an electric vehicle in the future, and that probably could make sure that you're not asking for too much power. And it's because we want to make it past this free of major deficiencies uh, by April 14th, and it's likely that they won't even take a look at, at our document before April 14th at this point when I did this video. It's, it's possible because they're running 20 days late. So that's my interpretation. Please leave your comments and please like this video. I will also leave comments in, 
any updates or any new videos I have, take a look at my other videos. I wish you a lot of luck on your project.